it's Elizabeth from Fern Creek Stickers and I'm here today to plan the week of June 26th. So I'm gonna be using this neutral safari kit this week. This is an August kit, um, but I actually went through and figured out all my kits for July and August and this was what I was not gonna be using in the other planner that I'll be starting next week. And so I figured I would go ahead and use this in my weeks since I won't be using it later. Um, you can see here, how's, here's how last week turned out. I did not get much done on my to-do list and I did not do very well on my habits either. So it was, um, I had my fourth anniversary sale this past week and the sale prep took up a lot of time and then I kind of got on a roll. I was trying to make some grab bags and once I got going, I couldn't stop. So I was working on some other things. So a lot of the same to-dos are gonna carry over to this next week. So let's get started. So I am actually, I am still kind of shocked by this myself. I am going to be switching to a Hobonichi cousin starting next week. Like if you had told me that I was going to be using a weeks and then a cousin, like that I would be in Hobonichi planners. If you told me that six months ago, I would not have believed you. I, I've talked about this before. Like I just never, I had never really seen the appeal. The paper just didn't seem great. I didn't understand why people like these planners so much, but now I get it. Now that I've used the weeks, I've really enjoyed it. And I'm going to give the cousin a try now. I want to, I've got more going on. I'll be back to work in about six weeks. So I've got more happening that I want to plan. And um, I think having the daily pages and then having a more traditional weekly spread will be really nice because that's I really like the daily duo but I did miss having a weekly spread but I felt like if I planned in a weekly planner as well it just felt redundant and so I think having it all in one place will be really nice to be able to get that weekly overview but also be able to go into more detail on a daily basis so I'm really looking forward to it but the reason I'm not switching yet because obviously well I guess I'm starting switching starting with July um, and July does start at the end of this week but I actually decided I got I ordered an Avec which is the cousin but split into six months um, and I mostly I did that I well I learned that it existed this week and <laughs> then I was like oh I need that because the cousin that I have right now <clears throat> has a bunch of random pages where I've tested out stickers and otherwise it's totally empty and so it just seems obviously I could totally use it it's very functional but it just seems you know it's nice to have kind of a fresh start and not just have like a half empty planner that I'm going to be using. So it was like, this is perfect timing. I can get this planner that starts in July and get it started, but it won't get here until this week. So I'm doing this week in here and then next week I will officially be moved into the cousins. So again, I'm excited about that and I've been, you know, looking on Instagram for some inspiration. And I also like too, with my daily duo, obviously you've seen this with my plan with me's, I would plan out the whole week in advance, but I like that what I think I can do with the cousin is I can plan the, the, um, the weekly spread, which gives me kind of like everything in one place, an overview, and then do the plan the daily stuff every day in the morning. And I also like the possibility just, I don't know, it gives you more creativity and, um, yeah, can kind of play around and just do so many different things with the daily pages. So I am really looking forward to getting started in that planner. And I'm gonna have two, I'll have a video um, with a haul with some accessories I got. And I also <clears throat> ordered a bunch of pens from Jet Pens because as you know, I'm not totally satisfied with my pen situation on the um, Hobonichi paper. So I want to play around with some different pens and see what I like the best. So anyway, so I'm gonna get started with planning out this week. And so the big thing that's happening this week is Daniel is getting baptized on Sunday. And so my parents are coming in for the baptism. My mom has been here a lot since he was born, <clears throat> but my, I need to put my date dots in. Let's see, this is the 26th. My dad has not been here since December, since Daniel was um, three weeks old. So it's been a long time since my dad has seen him. So my parents will be here and then Brian's whole family who they live within driving distance, they'll come in for the day on Sunday for his baptism. So it'll be great to have family here and to see people. And um, so I'm really looking forward to that. The other big thing we have going on is so I'm filming this on Sunday night and tomorrow we have a 
an appointment with a pediatric GI specialist. So I've mentioned Daniel has some GI issues and that have been ongoing and our pediatrician had said, you know, it's you really need to go to a specialist now. So we're going to the specialist tomorrow and he is three and a half hours away. So it is going to be a long day and, but our pediatrician said it's worth going to him even though he's further away because he's the best. So I'm really hoping that we get some answers at our appointment tomorrow. And okay, so again, I'll do my cleaning over here and I'll do social media stuff there. And I will layer it like that. <clears throat> okay, so let's see what we've got going on this week. So I'll start with on Monday, we have the doctor's appointment and that will really be all day because we are going to be spending a lot of time in the car. Fortunately, Brian has the day off, so we've got <laughs> we've got two adults to take care of this. So doctor's appointment, that will be all day tomorrow. Then let's see, you've got kind of my normal stuff going on. Oops. Sorry, I'm like, I don't want to put this sticker on the, the same color even though I do when I've done like color blocked days I really do like them so I don't I don't know why but you know I'm trying to mix up the colors here <clears throat> so trash day also I should say this kit has been super popular animal prints are not really my thing but I do like neutrals and like the, I, I am I'm liking this kit like but it's not it's one of those sometimes I'm designing for me I'm like I love this. Sometimes I'm like, okay, I know other people love animal prints, so this is for them. But I'm actually, like, I'm feeling pretty good about this kit. I like it. Um, okay, so we've got trash day, and then we'll need to gather up trash on Tuesday. Then... On Thursday, so I'll go to the grocery store on Thursday because we need to, we went, I went yesterday, but we need to figure out what we're serving people for lunch after Daniel's baptism. So, and, and what we're going to eat when my parents are here. So we need to make another trip to the store once we figure that all out. So they won't get here till the afternoon on Thursday. So we'll be able to go grocery shopping and then <clears throat> let me put that my parents are gonna get here, which is very exciting. Use the airplane. <clears throat> and write very tiny in this box. And that's Thursday and then Sunday will be the baptism and we'll use this banner and put Daniel's baptism yeah, and we don't, at this point, we don't really have anything planned when my parents are here. Mostly everything that we can think of that we want to do is outside and it's going to be like high 90s. So not awesome for outdoor stuff. So we will see. Um, the good thing is my parents are very like, they're, they're amazing and they'll go along with whatever. But it's like they come and my mom has come so much to help that I want to give them a trip where they can just like enjoy it and we can do stuff together and not me being like, mom, can you do all this stuff? So we'll see. We'll see. Okay. And I'm going to fill my social media in later because I still need to figure that out. Then cleaning. I want to front load cleaning this week so that I have stuff done before my parents get here. Vacuum the whole house, which this is, <clears throat> we have a Dyson cordless vacuum, which highly recommend definitely worth the money, but vacuuming the whole house that will be a bit of a project usually i divide it into upstairs and downstairs because i can't do the whole house on one charge but i will want to do all the vacuuming one day so i'll need to make sure i start in the morning so i can recharge the vacuum in the middle and then i will do the kitchen and the floor is downstairs 
But now, why did I write, I'm, I'm look, I have notes here. And I'm like, why did I put downstairs floors? Because really this means the bamboo floors. I, I don't know what I was thinking. I'm gonna do all the vacuuming. And then, but the floors, they really need a good scrub. So that, that will be a big project. Sorry, I'm like talking to past Elizabeth here being like, what, what was going on? So that's what's there. Oh, and then the other thing, shoot, I should add laundry in. We actually, weirdly, we didn't do laundry this weekend. And I think it's because it, with coming back from traveling last week, it happened later than normal. So um, I guess we'll be gone all day tomorrow. So Tuesday, some laundry will need to happen. And again, that'll be good to get done before my parents come. If we need to do a little laundry when they're here, not a big deal. Cause I mean, having a baby, you spend a lot of time at home, but nice to have that stuff out of the way. So I think that that's kind of what I've got there. Then I'll put my to-do list over here and hopefully make more progress on this than I did last week. But again, I wanna to try to get this stuff done before my parents come so that I can enjoy time with them. Let's see, I'm just like, layer all the stickers. I'll put the to-do on a sticker and then layer it over this. Yeah, there we go, that looks cute. I was gonna say there can't be too much sticker layering, but I'm sure, I'm sure one could layer stickers too much. I'm sure it could happen. But yeah, it has been, getting hotter and hotter and I'm a little scared for how hot it's gonna be by the end of this week. But winters in Alabama are quite nice. So it's a trade off, but I'll take it. Okay, so things that I did not do last week that need to happen again. But I did order the cutest baptism outfit for Daniel. So, you know, there's that. Inbox zero. I have a lot of emails and most of them, most of them are like news alerts from when I was on vacation. So, but I just need to sit down and get through all those emails and I need to do the listings for September. Get those done before my parents get, get here. We need to get gutters on our house and I need to contact some of our neighbors to find out who did their gutters and then plan the baptism lunch. And then I should go ahead and mark to that Saturday is the September release. And then I will put my habits in at the bottom. And let's see. I put my habits there and then I'll put what I'm reading. Which I'm still, this is kind of funny. I'm still reading the same book I was reading last week. I don't know why I was reading on Kindle and my Kindle told me that I had like, that I was very close to the end and it turns out I was not, which is really, I have not had that happen before. I've only had it happen where I had a book where like half the book was at the, was in the Kindle book twice. So I thought I had way more left than I did, but this one, um, I had way more of the book. So I thought I was almost done. And then it turned out the Kindle just was telling me wrong. So, um, so yeah, I think that that is what I have going on this week. So again, excited to see my parents, excited for Daniel's baptism. And also the weeks has been so much fun and I'm looking forward to trying a new planner and being in the cousin. Again, I never thought I would have been uh, becoming a Hobonichi stand, but here I am. So I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that you have some good things planned for the week ahead and I'll see you all again soon. Bye everyone.